If you are tired of the same blue folder icons what Apple has been using for years, switch it up with some custom ones. First, what you need is an image. It should be PNG image without the background. As an icon, you can use anything, but I like to stick with the folders. For your convenience, I have put these 8 different colors of folders on the Apple Online Academy website. You can download it there for free. The link will be in the description of this video. But now, the main question is, how do you change the icon? It's super easy. First, start by copying the new icon image with command C. Now I will create a new folder. You can do it from the right click menu or by the shift, command and shortcut. And as you can see, this is a standard blue folder. Now right click it or control click it once more and select get info. Again, even this step can be replaced by a shortcut, which is command I. Once we have the info open, it is as simple as selecting the image of the folder on top and now press command V to paste the previously selected image. Now the folder is grey. Good thing is that if you copy the whole folder, it will copy the style as well. So now I have two grey folders. And I can just select this one, press command C to copy and command V to paste it here. And the folder is changed again. It's really quick way to customize the folder icon and it will create more visual solution which might help you to find the folder you need a little bit faster. That is why Apple Online Academy channel is here, to save your time and find and share all these tips and secret features. So subscribe if you really want to master your Mac. And at the end I should also mention how to remove the icon. You can of course delete the whole folder and make a new one. You can also replace the icon same way with this blue one, which is included in the downloadable pack. But the easiest is to just open the info again and press command X on the icon, or alternatively the cut command from the edit menu. That will restore the default settings. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial and I wish to see you in the next one as well. Thanks for watching.